Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. I have said on several occasions I'm a fan of Sightmark Optics. They offer a lot for the money. Here's the upper on my Diamondback DB15. I've got a Sightmark Wolfhound 3x24 on there. It looks a little different. It is housed with this rubber outside material that is very rugged. This is a great my optic. I've been very point. happy with it. I've spoken about it and it's always performed great for me. On my CMMG Banshee, chambered in 5.7 by 28, I've got a Sightmark Ultrashot M-Spec. It looks like an EOTech. It's much less expensive than an EOTech. You can see it does have the shroud on there, an excellent reticle. It holds zero, and this has been great on this firearm. I've been very impressed with it, and also priced well. Well, here we've got my Ruger Max 9, and what I have here is a Sightmark Mini Shot A Spec M3 Reflex Red Dot Optic. This is featured on Ruger's site where it says Shop Ruger. Upon the launch with the Max 9, Ruger featured this. Now let's stop right there. For Ruger to feature anything on their site, it has to be tested thoroughly for longevity, ruggedness. They, they don't feature any junk. All right, let's just get that out of the way right now. So they, they feature this right here. I think it goes for around 169 and change. And that is what I'm talking about. To, to get an optic that's 400 bucks, um, that, that to me is, in many cases, as much as you pay for the pistol itself. And that's what kept me away from red dots initially. But something like this offered everything that I want. Let's get into it. It has a, a clear dot 3 MOA auto dimming. So there are no adjustments. It is always on. They say 100,000 hours of battery life, which is approximately four years with a standard CR2032. And it is always on auto dimming. So if it is daylight, it's gonna be a little bit brighter. If it is low light conditions, it's gonna be a little more dim but it does offer a nice clear dot. Aluminum housing, it is shockproof, it is waterproof, it, it's a great optic. I've been very happy with it. Now, I I've taken this gun to the range on three occasions and just a couple turns with the elevation, couple turns with the windage, and I had it sighted in really well. I've been very happy with it and I, I, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to show you how happy I was with it. Now, if you go with the case, here's the user's manual, the hex wrenches to mount. It gives you the, the rag to clean the glass. Those are the hex. Now, I mentioned I was happy with it. I got another one. Now, this is mounted on a another mount for a pick rail. I'm thinking about putting this on my Desert Eagle. I'm not sure yet. Uh, I'm, I'm thinking about it. But... I, I got another one because I really like this optic. I think that it is going to offer longevity, which is what, what you want. And it's actually rated, what they say, it was, I'm going to put a little, I don't even know what this caliber is, but I'm going to put it down here. It's, a, it's rated up to that. So that tells me that it'll work fine on the Desert Eagle. I mentioned I've taken it to the range on three occasions. Let's roll through some of that footage. We'll come back and talk more about this Sightmark mini shot. Sightmark Mini Shot A Spec M3 has the same footprint as a Shield RMSC. So if you see that a firearm offers a red dot plate with the Shield, it will work with the Mini Shot A Spec. One of the things I really appreciate about this optic is that it does have rear sights. I may be able to show it better with this one. See that? In case your battery dies or something goes wrong you still have rear sights right there to work with your 
front sight. I don't know if you could see like that, but it's definitely on there. That I can guarantee. And that is something that I think should be standard with red dots on pistols because anything that is mechanical, you know as well as I do, could go wrong. And sometimes it does. And you'll still be able to use your fiber optic tritium front sight with that rear sight if something goes wrong with this. But there it is. Sight Mark Mini Shot Ace Back M3 under 200 bucks. I've got it on my Ruger Max 9. I hope I demonstrated it well. I certainly felt like I did when I was at the range, but I think this is a very nice optic and it's priced well. And you know, it's got everything that I want on an optic. And if you're if you're looking to get into red dots on handguns, this would be a great place to start. And I think you may be like me and possibly get a couple if you like videos like this please subscribe and share i always appreciate thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe